My name is Tammy Rivera Malfers. I grew up in Baltimore from the age of seven up until the age of 24 when I met my husband and I moved to Atlanta, Georgia. We have a TV show, which you are watching now, called Walker and Tammy What the Flocker, which I think it should be called Tammy and Walker What the Flock. The most exciting part for my show last season was being able to go back to my hometown of Baltimore and people actually get to see where I come from. We live on the third floor. There's a one bedroom up there, and these be me, my mama, Becky, Keisha, Tony, and Becky, her father all in that damn house right there. That's something that has never been covered on TV before. That's something that I never really talked about a lot. So um, that was the most exciting part for me. This season, fans can look forward to more layers being peeled back of who we are, what we stand for as a family and as individuals. I should think this world was tough and rough and buff and you couldn't be sentimental and show sensitivity, but when I got a daughter, you showed me that. You showed me life ain't about going hard in the pain. You know what I mean? It's about going hard playing with paint with your daughter, so. I don't think anything can make me closer to Walker. I feel like we're as close as we're gonna get. There's a lot has, that has changed since last season. Um, the house has moved forward. You know, we've been having stops and hiccups with that. Charlie has grown up a little bit more. It's like a lot going on with her at this point. I think we're, we're, we're getting better with understanding how to deal with her and her teenage stuff. So do y'all kiss? Yeah. What you mean, yeah? You <laughs> How many times y'all kiss? I mean, everybody in a relationship kiss. You kiss my dad. And I'm finding my balance in trying to find my peace. Like, I have a whole album finished, right? Mm -hmm. I'm just not, I don't know what's going on. I'm just not in the space anymore. Like, and everybody and Walker keep like, you need to get the music, put the music out, you need to do this, well, you need to do that. Well, I agree with that too, but you still have to take care of you first. If putting that on hold right now, is what you think you need to do, then put it on hold. What I'm looking forward to this season will probably, I'm just ready to sit back and watch it like everybody else. Because, you know, when you're filming and you're going through life, you don't even remember what you were filming. So I'm just as excited as, as everyone else is to watch it myself and be like, oh, I did that.